do you hear that? That is the music of greatness. Oh, man. This masterpiece, as the title says, is 20 years old. Now I'm quite a few days late on this because I got other stuff to do. And also, I want to apologize in advance that I can only record this in OBS because my other programming software does not pick it up. It doesn't pick up the game, and if I record the screen, it records my desktop, not the game. I mean, bruh. So, this is all gonna be one MP4, no multiple audio layers, just everything. Oh uh, yeah, this is gonna be messed up. Alright, so Gothic, 20 years, this amazing game. You have, you have had your Smash Brothers, Nintendo, Mario, Luigi's, the Halos, and whatnot, but second. this, this game, oh! During the long years of his reign, he was able to defeat Is all foes of his the realm. First or second? Oh. All except one. So yeah, orcs came, steamrolled humans. This is this is a very old game. Thanks for your help. It's your. He didn't do shit. I'm deaf. But yeah, this is a very old game. 2001, 20 years. So this game does not hold your hand at all. You see an NPC? It has a name. You need to talk to him. It just if you want XP, if you want quests, if you want stuff. So what is great about this game? I don't know. It's just it's it's good. It really it's it really captures that fantasy fantasy RPG type of game or gameplay. It is very rewarding. For half of the game you can literally be stuck with one weapon. Exploring is heavily heavily encouraged because you find a lot of stuff. Now combat in this game, whew, that's another beast of its own. You see, this is not like your Skyrims, where you can just press a button, you have your weapon, and you can press the mouse button all you want to swing your weapon all you want. No, you have to press the action button, and then you have three options. You can hit, go forward, you can hit from right to left, and vice versa now you can combo these together and if you combo them correctly then you can dish out some pretty good damage but it is very easily to get very very easy to choke because if you either attack too soon or too late he won't attack for example i press right and immediately left he doesn't do anything Unless the animation is finished. But if you time it right... Boom. There you go. So, finding a trainer, learning weapons really helps. For example, with swords, the threshold of you choking gets thinner and thinner. You can just do... And just slice and dice anything that comes in your way. Kyo, why are you playing VR chat now? Now, I did mention exploring is encouraged. But... The game, what the game does well is there's kind of a soft lock because you can go explore all you want, anywhere you want, essentially, unless it's a very important mission part, in which case you don't have access to it. You can go explore anywhere in the world you want, but there will be monsters that will just absolutely shred you to bits. So it's up to you if you want to go around, grab stuff, sell it or do quests, become stronger, and then, you know, you can go there. But yeah, once again, the combat is just, I, I don't know, it's, it's horrible. Now, one-on-one -on -one is fine, but there's usually very uncommon to find mobs that are alone. Now, th these are alone essentially because it's kind of the starting area. But if you ever run against goblins, oh boy, there's like 10 of those. Now sound design, I mean, it's for that year when it came out, it's pretty good. The music though, oh, the music. 
Oh, I just... I Everything about this game is just imperfectly perfect. If that makes any sense. You have your journal when you have where you have your quests. And that's it. You don't get a marker. You don't get anything. You talk to a dude. He tells you, I had the cave to the east. And you're like, okay. You go to the east. It should be somewhere around here because he mentioned it could be nearby. In reality, you need to walk that way 10 minutes. And then there's the cave. Now, this, I, 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 really, I really like doing this bug because it's just simple. Now, these dudes will stop you because you don't have access to the inner castle. Just do the same thing. Put, put the weapon down. And that is essentially how to get really easy XP and some items at the start. Because you have a letter for the fire mages. And you give that to this dude. Why is that log floating? <sighs> oh, I love it. Hey, man. Oh, no, he stopped me. No, 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 no. Tell me. Leave me alone. Ah, a fight. There we go. Okay. He's very annoying. He can literally follow you to the end of the game. And I am not kidding. I don't, I don't know, but for me, I just love the voice acting in this game. I, I don't know why, it might might not be that good, but I just absolutely love it. You look at a guy, you hear his voice, and you're like, yeah, that, that's a voice I could imagine for him. Same goes with monsters, honestly, and swords. Oh, that sound. Oh, I love it. Now, that lizard will absolutely mess me up. Maybe. Unless you're really skilled and you can actually hold yourself. Oh, it's not attacking me, what the hell? I choked. Okay, never mind, one shot me. Oh yeah, you don't have a map. You need to find a guy, a, s a merchant that will sell you a map. Oh no, there he is. Oh no. Don't pay attention to me. Oh, you know, please, just... I believe he can run into the castle, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> he can run into the castle, but I can't. What's up? Yeah. You can't enter the. Oh my God! Come here, mud. What do you intend to clear? Winner, there we go. I'd say. You don't even get XP for killing him, bruh. What do you intend oh, yeah. to if do with the weapon, man? If you don't kill, you can't kill people with a sword unless you do that. It's a real shame that what they're doing is a remake of this game, not a remaster. Ah, that's, that, that's, that, that's such a shame. Uh, uh. Enemies in this game, or monsters, enemies, whatever, they do not respawn. The only time the monsters will respawn is when a new chapter starts. So in this game, put the damn weapon away. It is very important to do every quest you can before you actually start progressing through the main path. Here, how is the lock picking there? You have a chest. It's locked. What you want to do is save, click on the chest, and you have two options, left or right. 50-50. That's the right one. So the pattern starts with left, and my pick lock broke. Left, left, right. Never mind, it's left again. After a while, you will kind of get a hunch i would say as to what what could come next for example if it has three left what are the chances it, the next is going to be a left keep it to yourself maybe don't need to know it turns out pretty high four left right right damn it four right left right Still not the end. Left. Yes, opened it. What's up? That's actually a really good necklace. Woo! Protection. Check everything I have. There you go. Enter. Accept. Sure, why not? There you go. You got yourself a map. You just open your inventory. Find the map. And press. I'm gonna press action button on it. There you go. There's your map. There's the whole map of the game. And also this. For some reason, this is in the game. 
I mean, I'm not complaining. How does the wolf help? Alright, they're pretty, they're pretty chill. They're pretty chill. Well, yeah, these dudes are snappers. They are mean. They are vicious. There's usually a lot of them. And they're fast. Also, for some reason, we can do that. But yeah, I think I said, I mean, I, I could just talk about this game this whole day, like I mentioned. So that was Gothic 1. 20 year old game, 20 year old masterpiece. It's probably my favorite game of all time. I just absolutely love that game. It just, it, it's it's really immersive. The sound, the sound design, the soundtrack is just the ambience, voice acting, monsters. It has everything. It's just so good. The only thing that it lacks is the combat system because that is just ink. But you can find a workaround or that if you want, if you feel like to, if you're skilled enough. But yeah, hopefully they don't ruin the remake, which should have been a remaster. But hey, it is what it is. So thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, I mean, grats because I'm just ranting how good this game is. But yeah, hopefully again, hopefully you enjoyed the video. You take care. You have a good one. I'll see you next time, whenever and whatever that might be. Peace.